It's funny, isn't it, how little things that happen in the world can completely change your viewpoint on things. Um, <clears throat> what's been happening with Hillary Clinton, especially now that the FBI wants to investigate her again, has to be said, which is absolutely hilarious. And... Um, enjoyable because you know being a so-called or anyone in the so-called conspiracy research field um, obviously gets a lot of heartache from a lot of people ordinary folks who uh, have a go at you and say you're a bullshit or all of that kind of stuff whereas I can remember having conversations with those very types of people uh, saying things like uh, when they were saying, you know, doing the politically correct thing of saying, oh, Donald Trump, you know, he wants to, wants to, like, put a label on Islamic people and stop them from coming into the country. Uh, no, that was actually the French president or prime minister who said that and was actually starting to do it, not actually Donald Trump, to which their reaction is, oh, it doesn't matter, you know, Donald Trump's still evil. So it's, like, politically correct just to say that Donald Trump is evil when, uh, obviously, when you say to people like back then months ago well oh, Hillary Clinton basically just as evil if not much much worse she's essentially in the same same realm as Tony Blair she's just like a walking criminal and she needs to be put in jail and uh, people are like no no Hillary Clinton great you would like to think unless people are just completely self-defeating they will now actually finally accept that Hillary Clinton needs to go to prison, or at least to be criminally investigated properly, and hopefully that will happen. Uh, the one thing that has really changed uh, in my mind is the appreciation of this statue in Trafalgar Square, which, to be honest, is hideously horrible. And, uh, I mean, I went to art college for five years. I think I can sort of maybe understand art quite well and uh, that's always just not really struck right with me apparently it's a really positive really positive feature of the square big thumbs up but you'll you may well know that in a lot of the world a thumbs up is actually an insult it means stick it up your ass and uh, the fact that the thumb is elongated is really an insinuation that it's to be stuck up your ass. So it's not really a positive message, it isn't a non-positive message, a negative message. But actually, um, you know, finding out that Hillary Clinton's actually going to be investigated properly, hopefully, by the FBI, um, brings a new swing to this thing. Suddenly it's like, yeah, a positive message can be, stick it up your ass, Hillary Clinton. So it's quite good, really. And seeing Hillary Clinton's face when she had to uh, sort of announce that she was being reinvestigated and saying things like, oh, whatever it might be, I'm, I'm still going to win. And looking at her face, how she was trying to smile, that sort of facetious, horrible, fake smile that she's been pulling a lot. Um, well, in, in that particular uh, little speech she made, it wasn't just she was trying to put on a fake smile. She literally looked like she was going to be passing away, like imminently. I wouldn't actually be surprised if it, Hillary Clinton's health actually just completely failed um, because of her being reinvestigated. There must be a lot of pressure on her, and I wouldn't be surprised if she just dropped dead. What I'm really worried about, though, is actually that she will still get elected. I mean, what a world that would be, where somebody can be so obviously an arch criminal and display such flagrant criminal behaviour and still get elected. If Hillary Clinton gets elected, the world is going to go very strange. It's going to be like a, a really macabre version of 1984, where you know the entire planet is seemingly the opposite of what most people think it is. Let's hope she doesn't get elected, but watch this space. You may be watching this video once she has been elected or not elected. Who knows? All I know is this statue is, hooray, stick it up your ass, Hillary Clinton.